Okay, this is the video of the Arcturx harness and so on. I'm um, just trying to show that it's not too worn and whatnot. We've got scratches on the front here, which is, uh, I mean, it's obviously to be expected. Um, you can see here the um, labeling one that's at large, somewhere in there. As I said before, you've got all the labels looked after in there. Um, importantly, sort of leg loops and so on. So this is the version with the adjustable leg loops. Again, a bit of scratching on the anodizing and whatnot. Um, importantly, of course, is the area, your tie-in area and so on. You know, it's very minimally worn. I've mostly used another harness, which is why this one's in such good condition. It's actually, just for what it's worth, it's super comfortable. Um, yeah, it's really useful having this really wide belt. I think what they call it. Wasabi belt or something. Other oh, leg loop has some minimal wear on this. You can see the sort of it's very, very surface level problems up at the back side of this as well, and the gear loops. So I'm going to try and spot any. Issues. You can see that, you know, obviously it's sort of slight fading on the on the nylon and so on. But um, apart from that, this is in really good condition. Back in the day when art trucks used to make some absolutely bomber kit. I don't care for them much anymore. A little bit of wear on this, but the fabric's fantastic with this. Very very good. It is. Almost, I mean, it's in bloody good condition. I think they're about 135 pounds each, and so on. You okay? Fancy a lot.